<clears throat> All right, we are here with uh, the Dubuque Spartans after a really close 8-7 loss to open uh, the Duluth Regional. We're here with head coach Paul Wojcicki and uh, Thomas Kempf, uh, who had five RBIs in the game today. Coach, if you want to go ahead and just start off, talk a little bit about the game and how your team played today. Yeah, you know, I, it was kind of a heartbreaking way to lose the game. Uh, <clears throat> But you got to give no sense of credit. They're, they're really a, a good ball club. And man, can they hit. Uh, uh, they don't. They barrel up a lot of balls. They don't miss too many. But I thought our kids really competed well. Uh, uh, what a great first inning. We come out and put three runs up. And, uh, you know, they you know, didn't blink an eye, came back and tied it up. And then from there on out, it was just a battle. Uh, and you go into the last inning, tied up 7-7. Seven seven. Uh, they uh, scored at the bottom of the inning and win it. Uh, I think one of the keys for us today was um, they had, I believe, uh, seven innings where they got the leadoff man on base and four of them scored. So, you know, that's one of those things in baseball we always feel like, hey, get, you know, get the first strike, get the first guy out, keep your guy pitching in the windup. We weren't able to do that today. So, uh, you know, hats off to North Central uh, for a, you know, a ninth inning walk-off win. Thomas, tell me a little bit about what you think your team did well today and how you can use that going into another game tomorrow. You know, I thought we battled really well today. Uh, for every punch we, we hit, they came right back at us. So, you know, we start 3-0, they come back right back 3-3, three, 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 tie game for a while. We put two on, they put one on and take the lead the next inning. And, you know, we just keep fighting. I think the, we know as a team, we're a late team as well. We can hit with late, we can score runs late. And, for tomorrow, we're just going to keep fighting and hope for the best. Tell me a little bit about what this experience has been like for you to be able to be in a regional and, you know, be a part of this for the first time. It's really great. It's, it's kind of surreal, you know. You win a conference and then you win a tournament and then you're, you're here. You're, we got guys that are supposed to graduate this weekend and they're still playing. So it's a lot of fun to be out here with uh, these guys. Some of them we won't see for a long time. So um, it's just been a really great experience. Coach, what are some of the things you'll talk about from today's game that you can use going into tomorrow, not knowing exactly who you'll be playing yet? Yeah, I think, you know, the, the biggest thing is you, uh, <clears throat> you you want to keep doing what we've been doing because we've actually been playing really well here for the last, uh, you know, five, six weeks. Uh, you know, I think we had a winning streak, what was it, Thomas? 11, 11, 11 in a row, and, you know, we came up a little bit short today. But, um, you know, I, I, I didn't feel like our guys were uh, – overly nervous or anything. I thought they came ready to play. And, uh, you know, again, uh, you know, there's some good teams in this tournament. And we, we have to play one that was in the World Series last year. But I know our guys will be ready to go tomorrow. It'll be, uh, be another fun day. And we're just excited to be playing here this time of the year. Great. Thank you so much, guys, and good luck yeah. tomorrow.